Hello, everyone. Layla is here. Today we have this most weighted miner. It's the Antminer AL1 Pro from Bitmain. We will review it for you, and we will tell you more about Alephium. Let's do it. Alephium, the first operational sharded blockchain that brings scalability and smart contracts to Bitcoin's proven core technologies, delivering enhanced performance and improved energy efficiency. Alephium combines innovative sharding, expressive SUTXO, and efficient proof of less work to secure scalable dApps for real world applications. On top of an awesome team, an outstanding community, and a lot of energy, it's scalable through sharding and programmable and secure, energy efficiency with proof of less work, custom virtual machine, and dedicated programming language. Alephium's token supply is capped at 1 billion. At mainnet launch November 8, 2021, 140 million tokens, 14% of the hard cap, were minted with the Genesis block. The remaining Alephium tokens will be mined over the next 80 years. The Blockflow algorithm is another critical component of Alephium's technology. This algorithm ensures that transactions are processed in an orderly and efficient manner, reducing the likelihood of network congestion and enhancing overall performance. By integrating Blockflow with sharding and the UTXO model, Alephium achieves a balance of scalability, security, and efficiency that is rare in the blockchain space. Alephium is mineable coin using algorithm Blake 3 and ASIC friendly. The market cap is 111 millions and the all-time high is $3. And it's listed in many exchanges also will be listed in Tangem. Unlike the other coins, there is no halving on Alephium, which you can mine and hold it for very long time. And also you can use it to integrate with Alephium ecosystem. We worked with Bitmain to make sure we can have an ant miner for Alephium. And we have now the AL1 Pro the most powerful and efficient miner for Alephium. Antminer AL1 Pro is similar to the other miners, like L9 and KS5 Pro in design, but it's a little bit heavier. It has a compact and sturdy design that's built for efficient cryptocurrency mining. AL1 Pro is equipped with four new NIDEC fans with 7,000 RPM that play a crucial role in maintaining optimal operating temperatures. These fans are designed to provide effective airflow, ensuring that the internal components stay cool even during intense mining activities. AL1 Pro power supply is the similar like L9 and KS5 and others, which is equipped with five high voltage 500 volt capacitors. This PSU is designed to operate within a voltage range of 220 to 277 volts, showcasing its versatility using P14 plug type, and it comes with its antwire. Antminer AL1 Pro control board is Civitech model CV1835CB3 and suitable for the new fans and comes with SD card slot. Antminer AL1 Pro comes with three hash boards. Each hash board comes with 84 advanced chips, they are aluminum backed with integrated bolts, heat sinks like the KS5 Pro. Antminer AL1 Pro offers 16.6 tera hash per second and comes with 84 chips on each hash board and it's super stable in hash rate. We did a test on the best pool so far for Alephium and it's via BTC. You can increase your rewards if you signed up using our link in the description and start mining Alephium. So don't miss out. We can also see the miner can make you up to $33 daily worth of Alephium.
Ant Miner AL1 Pro. Consume up to 3,730 watts with efficiency. 225 joules per tera on 16.6 .6 tera hash per second. Overall, the miner is great and the coin project very unique and worth to be supported, so you can mine and hold for long time. If you still have the chance, don't miss mining Alephium using via BTC with zero fees. You can find AL1 Pro from Bitmain official website, or you can contact with our partners Latin Mining, one of the biggest suppliers in China. You can check all the miners they have, including AL1 Pro, with good price. That was everything. Write me your thoughts about Alephium project and are you mining it? Don't forget to follow all our socials to connect with us and get good offers always. Layla was here. Peace out.